In this video, I will show you how to set up a public 5M server for free in GTA RP. I'll walk you through on how to set up the server and show you how your friends and everyone else can join. I'll show you how to access your server data folder to add more resources like vehicles, guns and more. And lastly, I will show you an overview on how to manage your server. So let's get started. To make this all work, we're going to go ahead and visit the link in the description. That will lead you towards my Discord server. Go ahead and verify yourself. After that, you will see all the channels. Scroll down and head over to links and resources. Click on free public server. Here you will see the links that we are visiting today. And the first one is going to be Airnote. Airnote is going to be the one that's going to provide us with a free public server. Click on it. Go ahead to client area and go ahead and create an account. After you've done that, go ahead and log in with that account. Click on services, order a new service. And here you can click on FX server. FX server one is a server that's going to be free. If your server grows, when it grows, you can go ahead and upgrade to a better paid subscription. So go ahead and click on order now on FX server one. After that, you can click on check out. Go ahead and check mark on the agree of terms and services and hit complete order. After that, you have to wait approximately 30 to 60 minutes because your account and order is going to be verified manually. You'll receive an email. The email is going to be account created. Go ahead and click the click on it and set up account. You're going to create a new password. This is going to be your panel password, uh, which is different from your account on ordering the server. Makes makes sure that you don't forget this password or else you won't be able to access the file. After you created your password, go ahead and click on login into the AirNode panel. Click on manage my server. Here you're going to scroll down, you're going to go to settings. And here you can create a server name. We're going to call it Epic Server and we're going to click on save. After that, we're going to go to startup. Here, we're going to go ahead and get a 5M license key. Go back to our Discord and now we're going to go to the second link. Click on it. You will be redirected to to this web page where you can also create an account if you don't have a CFX account yet. Right here you can create your account or log in with Google. Go ahead and do that and after that you will be logged in and redirected back to the Keymaster web page. Go ahead and register a new server. Go ahead and give it a server name. Then we're going to type in the IP address that is also in our Discord. Server type, we're going to do other home hosted. And we're going to name it AirNode. Again, thank you so much AirNode for providing this service. Go ahead and click on generate. After that, you can copy your key, go back to your AirNote panel and paste the key. On your right side, you can also choose the max players for this server. We're going to change it to 12. We're going to change the server host name to our server name. And we're going to go ahead and get the latest build of 5M which is going to be 6798 and we're going to type in 6798 after that we're going to go to network we're going to create allocation and remember your port 
30250. Gonna go back to startup. And here we are gonna change that port to the port we just noted. Go ahead and enable TX admin. After you filled all the data, go ahead to your settings in the panel and click on reinstall server. Now it's gonna this is gonna make take a few moments, so go ahead and grab yourself a coffee and leave us some feedback. After that is done, we're gonna go ahead and go to our console. We're gonna click on start and it's gonna load up all the files. Here you will see an address and a pin code. You're gonna click on it and you're gonna type in the pin code you just saw. That's gonna be 9381 for us. Make sure you fill in the one that you see. Go ahead and continue. You'll be automatically still logged in with the account you created before. And now you're gonna create a master password. Make sure again to back up this password, write it down somewhere because if you lose this master account, you'll not be able to access your files. Click on next, give it your server name, click on next, select popular and here you can choose DFX default 5M, click on save and go to deployer. Now you can click on next and here you can type in again your server key copy it paste it hit run wait for it to download and load everything hit next and then we're going to go ahead and edit something right here we're going to edit the ports go back to your panel click on network and copy your primary port Go back to Deployer and go ahead and edit these two lines like we do with your port numbers. Go all the way down and hit save and run. There you have it. It is starting up. Awesome. After that's completed, you can go ahead and go to your panel of Airnode again. Click on my servers uh, console and click on copy. You're gonna start up 5M. After you copy it uh, next to your server name, you're gonna hit F8 on your keyboard when 5M is loaded up. And this is how you're gonna connect to your server, but this is also how your friends and everyone else is gonna be able to join this server. Hit enter, wait for it to load. In the meanwhile, you can go ahead and smash that like button and hit that subscribe button so you can start following the channel. And there you have it, folks. Your serv server is fully active and working and everyone can join it. So we will build much more videos on how to upgrade and add more services. As you can see, if you hit T on the keyboard slash admin, you will get the TX admin menu. Uh, sorry, slash TX, you will get the TX admin menu where you can uh, set up everything you want. Teleport anywhere you want, spawn all the vehicles and much, much more. Make yourself familiar with this menu because you can also see the players and kick players out of the server and give announcements. So that's pretty awesome. And you can do much, much more. So we showed you how to create a 5M server showed you how to join a free public server and how your friends and everyone else can join now we are going to show you how you can manage your server files let's close up 5m firstly go to our discord and go to the third and last link we're going to visit today go ahead and download this application save it install it
and install for all users. Click on accept. Next. Next. And again, lastly, install. It's going to install it for you and you can hit finish. Now it's going to load it up. You can close that. You can close that also. You can go back to your AirNote panel and you can click on SFTP in your console. Go ahead and click on open the application we just installed. And there you have it. You can type in your panel password of AirNote. Having a headache today. Sorry about that. There you go. So we're going to be redirected to this folder right away. You don't need to do anything here. You're going to go in uh, TX data. There is where your folders and files are going to be. You're going to click on CFX default. Double click on it. And here you can add full resources, more scripts, vehicles, guns, and much, much more. This is where you want to add everything here. And so that being said, this is where you can manage your server. That being said, we're coming to an end of this tutorial. Our next videos will be more about how to add resources to the servers server and yeah let us know in the feedback section in the comment section if you also want us to show you how to install this but then a qb core because that's a bit different than what we installed today uh, let us know and please uh, leave us some feedback thank you all for watching and have a great day goodbye